Hello Sagittarius and welcome back to New Hope Tarot where we will be doing your reading for the first half of December. I have meditated upon the cards and I have pre-shuffled as always. I will shuffle live during meditation. Spirit showed me um, a really skinny rooster and after I noticed it, it it, I realized it was Hey Hey from Moana. And to me, what I got with that was don't act small. Don't be less than what you are. Step up your game. All right. So don't act small. Um, also, during the pre shuffle, during the pre-shuffle, the King of Pentacles kept coming out. Oh, I need one more card, actually. The King of Pentacles kept coming out. And um, it kept going, like, it was inverted, and then it was, you know, regular. And then it was inverted, and it just kept flip-flopping back and forth. And to me, what that says is that there are days where you may feel grounded, like you may have it all, like you have that confidence, oh, you know, and then there are other days that you don't. And it could be in regards to a specific topic or situation in your life. So take that how it resonates. But I found that it was very interesting because it was the King of Pentacles every time. All right, let's get your cards out here. We have the Queen of Swords in reverse. We have the Moon in reverse. We have the Emperor in reverse. The Knight of Swords, Two of Pentacles in reverse, and the Knight of Wands at the bottom of the deck. Let me just connect with this energy real quick. You may be feeling like you don't have all of the, either you may be feeling this or you don't. Um, you, you may be feeling that you don't have all of the facts, all of the details. You, you may not feel like you're the expert in this particular field, whatever that looks like for you. But the reality is you have some hidden talents. You have some truths that you know instinctively, but you're not listening to what those are. Hold on. The card just flipped. I was drawn to the fours immediately, and here they are, four, four, and four. Yeah, you may not think that you have the skills, the ability, the information, but the reality is, is that you actually have everything that you need to move forward in this, to create this, to whatever. Um, this could be in work, in um, a relationship, um, on a side hustle, whatever this is for you, you actually have everything that you need. You just need to go within and you need to recognize that for yourself. And then once you recognize that and you have that idea that you're like, oh, you know what? I actually do. I do have all of the information because you do. It's hidden within it's very much, it's there. It's all there. That's when you go, okay, 
I don't have to be flip-flopping back and forth like that king of pentacles, right? It's it flip-flopping. I don't have to flip-flop anymore. I don't need to go back and forth anymore. I can go straight forward. I can I can do this. I have the ability. I I am enough. I have enough. I know enough. Whatever this is, you have it. Okay? Here you are. I don't know if I have it. I know I have it. Okay? I know I have it. And that's after you go within yourself and you you do a little digging with and go, do I have all of the information? And you do. Do I have all of the abilities? You do. Okay? We have the five of swords in reverse, the page of swords in reverse, the four of cups in reverse, four of coins, four of wands, and the hermit card. I was drawn to that because it was just right there. You have everything that you need. Some of you, like I mentioned before, you're not listening to your gut instincts. You're not listening to your intuition. Literally, that's what I said earlier. So there it is. That's just that's just extra proof. What is going on here? The Wheel of Fortune. If you listen to your instincts and you go forth, things will start moving along beautifully. There it is. I mean, the cards do not get it wrong. Spirit does not get it wrong. All right. Pardon me one second. <coughs> <coughs> I'm still getting over this cough, you guys. I'm so sorry. Yeah, I feel like once you go within yourself and you start moving forward, things just start getting easier. Things start getting easier. You you start doing what's right for you. You just start moving along. Um with with this beautiful sense of um i can i can i will kind of an energy here i really like this i really 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 like this and here's the thing you still move forward with that i can i will sort of an energy even if you may still have some lingering doubts, right? M maybe some, um, a little bit of, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Insecurity or, um, uh, I can't think of the word right now. Spirit, help me out here. Help me out here, Spirit. I can't think of the word, so I'm going to move on. But then I'm going to I'm going to give you an explanation for this. Um, with the Four of Cups, Four of Coins, and the Four of Wands. You may not feel like you have something to offer sometimes, all right? But the reality is, is that what you have, what you have to offer is the right thing, that, that, that thing that is needed, whether like if it's in a company, it, you have that right that right thing. If it's in a relationship, you may not like, you may think that you're dealing with somebody that is outside of, um, of your level, right. Um, that maybe they're too good for you. But the reality is, is that what they're looking for is exactly what it is. You have, um, whatever that looks like for you. Okay. If you're looking for a home, you know, if you write a letter, maybe that you feel like that home is outside of your uh, financial ability, or maybe you feel like you're out of the running, 
If you write a letter and go, you know, this is the reason why I like this home and why you should consider me, even though my bid may be a little bit less. It just may be the thing, okay? And, and I'm telling you, look, Here's the TP here, and if you look at this, it's the inverted TP. It, it, and you have to build it from the ground up. It's all from a within source. It, 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 everything that you have is, is coming from a within source. I really like this. You just need to find what that source is from within, okay? With the High Priestess, Eight of Wands, and the Knight of Swords, you have to override that um, that feeling of doubt, of I'm not enough, with your intuition. That constant communication with your intuition to override that doubt. Okay, override that doubt. Go remember the High Priestess showed up here right? In reverse. So pay attention to your intuition. You have more than enough. You have more than enough. All right. What else do we need to let Sagittarius know for the first half? I got super excited. I thought that was the queen, uh, king of pentacles. <laughs> I was like, oh my gosh, there it is again. We have the Ace of Cups, the Queen of Pentacles in reverse, the Three of Wands in reverse, and the Tower. My beautiful Sagittarius, what I'm getting here is the fact that you have to love yourself exactly as you are. You have to appreciate all of who you are Everything that you have, everything that you lack, you, you really have to appreciate who you are in order for others to appreciate you as you are, right? Accept all of your quirks, accept all of your insecurities, accept all of it. Accept it as your personality, accept it as your enduring um, a quality because once you appreciate those things, that bit of you, all of it, and you embrace yourself, that's when other people accept and appreciate you for exactly who you are. All right. So expand that from within and you'll see that things start drastically moving, changing, the, it's like your your surroundings change because you change from within. All right, my beautiful Sages, that's what I have for you for the first half of December. I hope that did resonate. If it did, like, share, subscribe, and comment. And don't forget to click that um, notification button. All right, that way you are advised as to when I load the next video. Until we meet again, have a great one.